Hey, what's up everybody? This is Chris. Um, I just got done working on the E36, the six disc, six disc uh, CD changer in the back of the, in the trunk. Um, what was happening is the cartridge itself was not ejecting. Um, the six disc cartridge. Um, and so I got in there, I took uh, the unit off and wasn't too difficult. I think there's like six, six screws or bolts. And uh, what was going on is that this arm right here was not going back and forth. You can even turn it right here a little bit and it'll go back and forth. Uh, I gotta have like a screwdriver to put it in one of the spokes. Not recommended. But um, I played with that a little bit. Now it's working fine. I think it was just like stuck on something. Um, and also this little, there's a little, I'm touching it right here. This long little wire was not going, uh, it was kind of out and it was not tucked in as it is now. So I took off this little face plate right here. There's that screw, that one and that one. I took off those screws. And then I kind of tucked it back inside. It had come out. See how right now it's on the right side of this faceplate. I think before it was on the left. And I think that had something to do with it. I'm not exactly sure. Anyways, it's coming out. Now it's working. Make sure to check your fuse in the back. Um, mine was good. Uh, no problems with that. But, yeah, I'm just going to put this back together. I already uh, hooked it up to the power to make sure it's working. And it ejects fine. I got... I got this bad boy out and it worked for three times that I did it. Um, so let me know if you have any questions. I'm just going to put this back together. There weren't that many screws to take out. Um, it wasn't too difficult. You kind of just take off four of them, two over here, two on the other side, and you just kind of wiggle this thing off um, and then you can get to troubleshooting. Anyways, if you have any questions, let me know. Thanks. Bye. So here it is all freshly re in there. Um, I, uh, I realized I messed up on telling you some of the locations of some of the screws. They're actually on top for this unit and, but you'll figure it out. It's really easy. Um, but obviously you started by taking these three off and this one up here. Um, but here it is working. Perfect. Push you back in there. And I believe it's just checking now what CDs are in there, but I'm not sure. Anyhow, if you have any questions, feel free to post them. Uh, so basically what I did was I just took it all apart, played with it a little, make sure it, it still worked, and it did. I must have triggered something while I was doing that, because now it's working. Anyways, thanks. Bye.